Can we get a decent amount of breaks throughout the day? Just to make sure we're all, so we all stay hydrated. Yeah, it may be hot outside, but the band is marching on. That's the Niles McKinley High School Red Dragons Marching Band, so it needed to find ways to stay cool today as it prepares for the upcoming season. You know, arms up, shoulders back. Trumbull County reporter Nadine Grimley got to step in time at Bo Ryan Stadium today for band camp. Even in the heat, the show must go on. The heat is no match for us. With even higher temperatures expected Friday, it's making this year's band camp at Bo Ryan Stadium a hot one. Got a little bit worried because I know we're, most of us like to wear darker clothing, including me. I thought it was really crazy and I thought we wouldn't survive, but with the band moms having us have towels and pop schools and having this water um, sprinklers really helps. More than 100 students make up this year's Niles McKinley High School Red Dragon Marching Band, and they're all putting in a lot of work, practicing the music and choreography. Honestly, they are resilient. I mean, we're dealing with all this heat every single day. Well, people always think, like, we're not working that hard. It's as hard as, like, the football team or whatever, but it, is, it gets really hot and everyone's sweating. Band leaders are making sure these kids get plenty of breaks to stay hydrated. Since being out here on the turf, it's actually hotter than the temperature. It's maybe 10 to 13 degrees hotter in the sun, so we really have to be diligent in um, taking water breaks. Besides frequent breaks, misters by the concession stand also help keep the kids cool while they prepare for this season's home opener on August 17th. In Niles, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.